For these masks, I have two different sizes of bias tape. Uh, this is bias tape I made myself. It's 100% cotton made out of uh, muslin. Um, that way I can take heat for sanitiz uh, being sanitized. Now also I can take bleach without degrading over time. Generally the packets that you buy, um, they might be a mix with polyester. So I wanted to uh, avoid that since synthetic materials tend to break down with bleach. Um, I'm about to put in the uh, some of the metal. So I'm gonna go ahead and I've already got the metal put in on this side. Oof, buddy. I need you out of the way. Come on. All right, and for these ones, the scissor ones, these are quarter inch and these are half inch. Nay, 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 nay. So the quarter inch here is with one inch strips of muslin since it's a double fold. When it's completely open, it'll be, it'll be, um, one inch wide. So a simple way, if you don't have any kind of help uh, with um, tools for doing this, because there's something I got. There are these quick little things that um, let me go ahead with it. There are these. There are these little devices here that, let's see, this one will help or when you when you run it through, it makes um, a half inch. So you take a, a normal one inch strip and you slide it through this and then it can come out folded for a half inch. And then, then when you fold it over one more time, it'll be a quarter inch. Whereas this one here, you take a two inch strip and then you run it through this end. And mind you, you have an iron so that when you're pulling it out, um, it comes out folded as a single inch. And then once it's um, a single inch, you go ahead and fold it in half one more time and you iron it down. And then you get the half inch muslin bias uh, tape strip. The half inch one, it sews on a little easier. Whereas this one, it, it takes a little more finessing. Let me see if I can find the one that I have finished. All right, so on here, it comes out a little bit closer to the edge. So there's been times when um, if you're running it, if you if you're a little bit off, you'll you'll sew into the mask. You won't necessarily catch the the actual bias tape. So um, I know it, well. It's it's just a kind of a discretionary thing. Usually for the ends here, rather than try to try to fiddle with it, I just make a little knot at the end, and that'll help keep it from fraying. Whereas the actual half inch, this one here, is half inch. So half inch is going to catch um, easier and you're not going to, you're not as likely to have it um, slip on the other side because you just have more room to sew. I'll show you how to make bias tape. 